check this out this is a laser eraser uh, and uh, press I can't I couldn't read the I can't read the titles here laser eraser and press button okay and this was a good read it was a fun read okay and this is issue number four and I read uh, I think two or three issues of this and it was a fun read but a couple of things I highlighted here just to show you guys uh, one of the things that we talked about before Cheryl was asking as well I came across this advertisement right and this is a book put out by Eclipse Comics uh, women and the comics uh, by Trina I haven't tracked this down yet I, I highlighted it just to remind myself women and the comics okay by Trina Robbins and Catherine uh, Ronwad right and here's a description for it uh, women in the comics cartoonist Tina uh, Tina Robbins and comic book editor Kathleen Yarnwood have researched and written the first book about women's contributions to the uniquely American art form of comics a chronological survey from the turn of the century to the present women and the comics is a profusely illustrated profusely illustrated illustrated with examples from the cartoon cartoon art of Rose O'Neill the Cupsey Grace Drayton Campbell soup kids Dale Missick Brenda Starr oh Brenda Starr I have Brenda Starr Marge H uh, Henderson Bell little Lulu cool cool I have some little Lulu uh, Nisa McNeil and many many more right so it looks like this book and this book came out in uh, let's see 1986 right so this big book came out in 1986 from Eclipse Comics again we've read Eclipse Comics books before which are fantastic right uh, so I thought I would just you know highlight this Cheryl if you're into it or anyone else if you track this book down please uh, I keep on trying to remember to do this but I get, keep on getting lost please link it up in our gilded server on their comic books uh, I would like to get my hands on this book as well I'm gonna try to do the, to do this hopefully during the editing uh, of this live stream when I take out these segments maybe uh, if I do I might just load this up uh, entirely I gotta do the time stamps for him. But I'll remember to do this, okay? So, Women and the Comics by Trina Robbins and Catherine Yordwood. Okay. Something to track down. Something to track down. And one other thing I highlighted here, which was super cool, and it's from Eclipse Comics, right? Check this out Direct Marketing Comic Books. And this is books that you could have bought in 1986, right? 1986. And it's got price guide of some of the books that they were selling, right? Amazing Spider-Man 137 to 200 uh, for $2. 201 to all these for a dollar, dollar served by American flag. But up, but up, but up. It's got a lot of prices here, right? Super cool, super cool. We've looked at price tags before, uh, price guys before, uh, but I thought I would sort of show this as well, right? Just in case anyone's interested. GI Joe number one for nine seventy five. Check out GI Joe number two for thirty five dollars. So GI Joe number two in nineteen eighty six was selling for thirty five dollars. While number one was selling for nine seventy five, and then GI Joe, one of the most expensive GI Joe comics is GI Joe number twenty one, which is the silent issue, and here they were selling it for three dollars, right? So some of these comics haven't gone up in price. If anything, you could pretty much get them in dollar bin store uh, dollar bins or whatnot right what's this marvel fanfare 
and stuff but check this out oh elder god you rock uh elder god just posted our here you know what i'm going to turn on the chat for a second just to capture that is it going to come up there it is woman in comics is the first attempt to document the careers of the hundreds of women who have created and worked in the field of comic book strips comic books and cartooning okay we'll take that down turn off the chat now check this out check this out you got all these guys rocketeer appearances new mutants teen titans next men next man not next men next men is different right super curl web of spider-man dollar 50 thunder agents but check out the prices for x-men x-men number 95 good to find for 40 29 dollars in very fine to near mint for 40 dollars right check out these prices for x-men wow would like to get my hands on some of those right they got the dark uh, phoenix saga going on here as well x-men number 100 right very cool very cool very cool okay 